Listen, these kids are addicted to drugs. School districts, we have a drug problem. Can y'all go ahead and acknowledge the parents and acknowledge to the world that we have a fucking drug problem in these schools? Kids are addicted to vaping pens. They are addicted to these pills that they're getting from some of y'all's medicine cabinets. Now, hear me out. I'm not saying that it's the school's responsibility to fix the drug problem or the school's responsibility to heal or cure the addictions, but I am saying this. But if the schools say, hey, you know what? We're going to acknowledge that there's a problem and a problem exists. And to show that we acknowledge it, we're going to take about $25,000, $40,000 from the school budget and pay somebody to come in and do a dare talk. Y'all remember dare, right? Now, if they take that on as their responsibility, hear me out, at least get a relatable person in there to talk to those kids. I talked to y'all about this before, twice, twice, this year and last year. I've been forced to sit through an assembly put on by somebody that is cosplaying, cosplaying a black person in their hip hop costume, talking hip hop jargon to kids about the dangers of vaping, pushing 60 something years old, hat, Adidas hat to the back, a big piece and chain, an Adidas jogging suit, some Yeezys on, talking to the kids, yo, 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 homeboy, 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 about the dangers of vaping. And that's their fix. That's the school district fix. Let me tell y'all where we're failing. If the school district is choosing to make this their responsibility. You're talking to them about the dangers of vaping, how it affects their heart, their chest, their lungs, and all that shit. That's cute. That's cool or whatever. But why y'all not talking to them about the felony case they finna get hit with? Or the possible jail time they looking at? Why won't y'all pay somebody that looks just like them that's fighting a case right now? Or just got through fighting the case? I keep saying this and I'm screaming it because every fucking day, I swear, it keeps happening more and more and more. These kids are being arrested at school. They're being sent to the alternative school. Some of them are being hit with felonies. And nobody is talking about that as far as prevention is concerned. You're just talking about their heart health, their lung health. I know, okay? I'm no dummy. I know that there are kickbacks when y'all arrest these kids on y'all's campuses and you send them to the, the little DAEPs or whatever. You send them to the county or to the juvenile facilities. They place in front of your racist ass homeboys that are judges. The school get half the attendance money. The DAEP get the other attendance money. We understand that this is a business, okay? We get it. We also understand that whoever your homeboy is with the backwards hat on and Adidas suit is getting a kickback. If you are going to make it your business to be in the business of these kids when it comes to their addictions to drugs, please do right by them. Get a judge to talk to them. Get an attorney to talk to them. Get somebody that's fighting the case right now to talk to them. I'm just an English teacher, but maybe, just maybe, that may curb the number of cases that you're seeing on your campuses. But we know y'all really don't give a fuck about these kids. Parents, this how, this how we losing them.